Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice exponential equation 3 to the power x minus 9x is equal to 0. We will solve it by two methods. So, let us start with method 1. In this method, we move this uh, negative 9x to the right side. 3 to the power x is equal to this uh, negative 9x becomes a positive 9x at the right side. Now, from here we divide both sides by 3 to the power x. 3 to the power x divided by 3 to the power x is equal to 9 times x divided by 3 to the power x. And this 3 to the power x will be cancelled with this 3 to the power x and here left 1. So, 1 is equal to 9 times x divided by 3 to the power x. Next, 1 is equal to according to this property of exponents 1 over a to the power n is equal to a to the power negative n. We can write this 9 times x over 3 to the power x as 9 times x times 3 to the power negative x. Now, from here we divide both sides by 9, right side we divide by 9. So, 1 over 9 is equal to this 9 will be cancelled with this 9 and here left x times 3 to the power negative x. Now, we move this x times 3 to the power negative x to the left side and this 1 over 9 to the right side. x times 3 to the power negative x is equal to 1 over 9. Now, we want to use here Lambert W function that is W function of a times e to the power a is equal to a. To use the Lambert W function here, we must have same expression here and same expression here. As you can see in this function, we have same expression a here, we have same expression here a. But for now, here we have negative x and here we have positive x. To make this x negative, we multiply both sides by negative 1. The right side we multiply by negative 1. So, negative 1 times x negative x times 3 to the power negative x is equal to 1 over 9 times negative 1. Now, we have same expression here negative x and same expression here negative x. But to use the Lambert W function, we must have e in place of this 3. As you can see here in Lambert W function, here we have e. So, to bring e in this expression in place of this 3, we use the nature law property e to the power ln of a is equal to a. According to this property, e to the power ln of 3 is equal to 3. So, we replace this 3 with this e to the power ln of 3. Like this, negative x times replace this 3 with this e to the power ln of 3. e to the power ln of 3 whole to the power this power negative x is equal to 1 over 9 times negative 1. Next, according to property of exponents, a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m times n. We multiply this power ln of 3 by this power negative x. Like this negative x times e to the power ln of 3 times negative x negative x times ln of 3 is equal to 1 over 9 times negative 1. Now, to use Lambert W function, we must have same expression here and same expression here. But for now, here we have negative x times ln of 3 and here we have only negative x. To make this negative x same as this negative x times ln of 3, 
we multiply both sides by ln of 3 at right side we multiply by ln of 3 so ln of 3 times negative x negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power negative x times ln of 3 is equal to now at the left side we have same expression here negative x times ln of 3 and we have same expression here negative x times ln of 3 we can use the Lambert W function at the left side but we want to use Lambert W function on both sides at the right side too so first uh, let's make uh, this right side such that we can use Lambert W function on the right side so 1 over 9 according to natural log property m times ln of a is equal to ln of a to the power m this negative 1 this negative 1 will become the power of this 3 like this ln of 3 to the power negative 1 now this left side remains same and we continue on the right side 1 over 9 now according to this property of exponents a to the power negative n is equal to 1 over a to the power n we can write this uh, ln of uh, 3 to the power negative 1 as ln of 1 over 3 next this 1 over 9 this 1 over 9 is same as 3 over 27 so we can replace this 1 over 9 with this 3 over 27 3 over 27 times ln of 1 over 3 now we can write this 3 over 27 as we can write this 3 over 27 as 1 over 27 times 3 so we write this 3 over 27 as 1 over 27 times 3 times ln of 1 over 3 next 1 over 27 according to this property of exponents m times ln of a is equal to ln of a to the power m this 3 this 3 will become the power of this 1 over 3 like this ln of 1 over 3 to the power 3 and at the left side we have this expression negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power negative x times ln of 3 next 1 over 27 times ln of 1 to the power 3 is 1 divided by 3 to the power 3 is 27 now to use the Lambert W function that is W function of a times e to the power a is equal to a we must have e in this expression so to bring e in this expression we use this natural log property e to the power ln of a is equal to a according to this property e to the power ln of 1 over 27 is equal to 1 over 27 so we replace this 1 over 27 with this e to the power ln of 1 over 27 is equal to e to the power ln of 1 over 27 times ln of 1 over 27 next now we change the position of this ln of 1 over 27 we write this ln of 1 over 27 first and then this e to the power ln of 1 over 27 like this ln of 1 over 27 times e to the power ln of 1 over 27 and uh, at the left side we have this expression negative x times ln of 3 
times e to the power negative x times ln of 3. Now at both sides we have same expression here negative x times ln of 3 and we have same expression here negative x times ln of 3 and at the right side we have same expression here ln of 1 over 27 and we have same expression here ln of 1 over 27. So we apply lambda w function on both sides of this equation. So according to lambda w function this w function of negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power negative x times ln of 3 is equal to this negative x times ln of 3 negative x times ln of 3 is equal to and w function of this ln of 1 over 27 times e to the power ln of 1 over 27 is equal to this ln of 1 over 27 ln of 1 over 27. Next negative x times ln of 3 is equal to we can write this ln of 1 over 27 as ln of 1 over we can write this 27 as 3 to the power 3. Next negative x times ln of 3 is equal to according to this property of exponents 1 over a to the power n is equal to a to the power negative n. We can write this ln of 1 over 3 to the power 3 as ln of 3 to the power negative 3. Next negative x times ln of 3 is equal to according to this natural log property ln of a to the power m is equal to m times ln of a. This power negative 3 this power negative 3 will drop here. So negative 3 times ln of 3. Now from here we divide both sides by negative ln of 3. At right side we divide by negative ln of 3. So this minus will be cancelled with this minus and this ln of 3 will be cancelled with this ln of 3 and this minus will be cancelled with this minus and this ln of 3 will be cancelled with this ln of 3. So here left x is equal to 3. This is the first value of x. Now to find the second solution we continue from this line. This implies ln of 3 times negative x negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power this power negative x times ln of 3 is equal to and from the right side this 1 times negative 1 times ln of 3 negative ln of 3 divided by this 9 divided by 9 and from here we apply Lambert W function on both sides W function of negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power negative x times ln of 3 is equal to w function of negative ln of 3 over 9. So this w function of negative x times ln of 3 times e to the power negative x times ln of 3 is equal to this negative x times ln of 3. So here left negative x times ln of 3 is equal to w function of negative ln of 3 over 9.
Now, from here we divide both sides by negative ln of 3. So, x is equal to w function of negative ln of 3 over 9 divided by negative ln of 3. And if we put uh, this value in Lambert w function calculator, we get this value 0 0.1278694 we get the value of x is equal to 0 0.1278694. This is the second value of x and first we get the value of x1 is equal to 3. So, we have got uh, two solutions from this method. Now, let us solve this equation by method 2. In this method we move this uh, negative 9 x to the right side 3 to the power x is equal to this negative 9 x becomes a positive 9 x at the right side and uh, we divide both sides by x 3 to the power x divided by x is equal to 9 times x divided by x. Next 3 to the power x divided by x is equal to this x will be cancelled with this x and at the right side left 9. Next 3 to the power x divided by x is equal to we can write this 9 as 3 times 3. Next 3 to the power x divided by x is equal to 3 times we can write this 3 as we can write this 3 as 9 over 3. Next 3 to the power x over x is equal to this 3 times this 9 27 over 3 and 3 to the power x divided by x is equal to we can write this 27 as we can write this 27 as 3 to the power 3 divided by 3. Now, from here if we compare left side with the right side, you can see that 3 to the power x and here 3 to the power 3 and here we have in the denominator x and here we have in the denominator 3. So, it is obvious that x is equal to 3. So, from this method we get the value of x 3.